Smith Mountain Lake is a wonderful local resource when you're looking to get away from it all. And now you can take a bit of the lake's serenity back home with you thanks to some local artists. Carol Slane explains more about the visions of Smith Mountain Lake. That's the title of our um, show uh, this year, and we've had this before. It's wonderful because we have our artists to um, paint Smith Mountain Lake and their interpretation. And what's amazing is how different they all are. They definitely are, and I'm really caught by this one with the trees. And it, tell me a little bit about that artist. Uh, that's David Heath, and he is amazing. He paints very realistic, he, but he has the ability to even get the atmosphere into his paintings. Uh, they call that the Hudson River School. That's his technique, and it's just beautiful and amazing. I like it, too, because it's almost, it feels like an overcast day. Exactly, yeah, and very few artists can do that. So that's kind of his stronghold. And as realistic as that is, this is very impressionistic, this uh, Robert Sarsoni here. With the girl in the water, yeah. that's just lovely. Yeah. Isn't it beautiful? And the same artist can also be very realistic, too, because the one above it with the sailboat, um, that's a trompe l'oeil style. And that's, you, you feel like you're just standing right there. You could take that card down <laughs> that somebody pinned it up there. And I love that you guys came up with the idea of this, too, because I absolutely adore coming out here to the lake. And bringing that a little bit of that home with you is yeah. a wonderful idea. Right. It really is. It's, um, it's exciting. And we're going to have fun this Saturday because the artists are all going to be here. And... Um, we're going to have a party. We're going to have food and uh, fun, and we have games to play. When you um, buy purchases, you get possibly could win $25 off of a purchase. Excellent. The best thing is being able to vote on their favorite painting. Mm -hmm. And isn't there a chance to win a painting as well? Yes, there is. That beautiful painting over there of Rob, uh, Robert Shepard's, uh, the Smith Mount Lake painting, and all they have to do is pick their favorite painting, put it in there in the jar, and um, from that we get our drawing. And we also have other gifts that we give. Mm -hmm. This beautiful necklace here, this painting, pottery. We picked really beautiful things Excellent. to give away. Excellent. And Kay, I also want to talk about some of my favorite things here too. Your absolutely fantastic jewelry. Tell us a little bit about it. Oh, our jewelry is absolutely wonderful. Uh, we have featured uh, Mia Katrine, which one of a kind, pieces of jewelry. Um, and the other cabinet over there, which you'll go see later, is uh, Gary Dulac, which his things are 14 karat gold, sterling silver, and diamonds. They're just spectacular. We also have uh, excuse me, these wonderful pieces of um, the Smith Mountain Lake Charms, which were created to, uh, for us by Stan Adler, which was a very, very well-known uh, artist in his day, jeweler maker um, here at the lake. Has since passed away, but we still have the patent on that, so we are able to get this for a while. So really, you know, even in your jewelry, you're taking a little bit of the lake home with you. That's yes. a neat idea. Oh, absolutely, and people absolutely, they're wonderful gifts. You can put them on a charm bracelet mm -hmm. or wear them on around your neck. So either way, they are lovely. And us ladies, we always love jewelry. Oh, jewelry is <laughs> the best, our friends. Okay. <laughs> and I can't forget about the other room. You have, you know, all kinds of different things to choose from here, speaking of gift ideas. Uh, gift ideas, we have um, well over 250 artists and craftsmen here, American-made crafts in this gallery. Uh, wonderful potters wonderful glass blowers, uh, beautiful sculptures of bronze. Um, yeah, the gallery is just loaded down with goodies. And Kay, this Mia Katrine jewelry is beautiful, and I understand some celebrities have worn it? Yes, uh, she has made it for Sharon Stone and several other um, actors, actresses. And up here we're looking at some pretty popular um, paintings too. They're famous, aren't they? They are famous. These are done by Eric Fitzpatrick, and this was done for the Lake Effects movie. Each one of these pieces, there's four of them all together, uh, were featured as he was drawing and painting in his studio for the Lake Effects. 
So that's neat. So basically, you can come out here. You can get gift ideas. You can get yourself some jewelry. There's all kinds of things you can find. Absolutely. This is one of the most wonderful little spots to be at the lake. And if you'd like to check out the Visions of Smith Mountain Lake Art Show, that's this Saturday, June 9th. The demonstrations by the artists will be going on from 1 to 3 p.m. And, of course, the Little Gallery at Smith Mountain Lake is located at Bridgewater Plaza, lower level in Manita, 540-721-1596. And you can see all their art online at thelittlegallerysml.com.